right, this is the Launch CRP 909E. Uh, very good skin tool. I can tell you that right off the bat. Uh, nice set of buttons here. Very responsive screen. Good battery on this. Nice ruggedized case with a nice stand on it as well. Uh, I'll just get right into it. I think where this thing shines is going to be these two features right here. I can look at vehicle specific information here. So it will auto detect. The main one that you're going to see is an auto detect. Uh, so it will scan, read the VIN code, go in and look at and talk to all of the computers on your car so that you can get data out of them. You can get codes out of them. And you can look at that data over time. You can graph it and do a bunch of different information with that. Let me show you also this one that I think is probably where this shines the most. All of the resets that you need to do after you've serviced a car or in order to service a car. Brake resets, oil, life, oil light resets, steering angle resets. If you're working on a European car, you've got to reset for the battery. If you've had the battery loose, you need to relearn the throttle. Tire pressure systems. Diesel particulate filters, add blue. Again, these would be a whole lot of stuff for European cars so that if you've got to bleed this system out, if you've put a transfer case in, you need to relearn all of that. This is this is really a great set of features, certainly at this price point, and for pretty much any scan tool to have that set up, is that right there makes it worth the money right off the bat. Uh, what I like about the scan tool, you got a history function. A bunch of scan tools I've got do not have that function, certainly not in this price range. So that is uh, that sets this car, sets this apart. Let me just go through and I'll just set this up real quick. We'll let it do an auto detect and then I'll show you real quick a full system scan and then I'll give you my thoughts on that because I think that you're going to be impressed with this. This is a, a whole lot of scan tool for the money. All right, we'll let it go through. I'm going to tell it what position we're at what on the globe obviously and then we're going to let it go through and do a full health report for the for the car so this will go through and talk to everything on the car it will talk to all of these different computers and give me information specific to which ones have that and then I'll show you also it'll create a report so the report is if you're in a professional setting this will run through and make a PDF that I can email I can I can post it to a website if I wanted to I could do a bunch of different things in order to show a customer all the issues on their car also if I scanned a car before I got uh, before I got started and I knew whether what codes it had in the system before I got started so if there was any confusion about oh that wasn't or was there then I knew for sure which way it was like I say, this provides a nice setup here so I can go through and anything that's out of the ordinary, out of what it should be, is going to be highlighted. So again, I can share that here. I can I can add that in a bunch of different ways to a bunch of different spots and, and make use of that information really well. So if I want to go into the uh, engine control computer, I'm going to go here. And again, like I said... Uh, you can read fault codes, you can clear those fault codes, and you can look at the data stream, and I'll show you this. I think this is this is really good. This is what's going to be different about this versus a OBD scan tool. This has got 184 what they call data PIDs, uh, parameter IDs. All of these are specific to Toyota. So Toyota creates this list, and these are all the things that your computer can actually see, and it realizes what these uh, voltages are, what these ratios are, and you can look at all of that information. So if I wanted to select all of that at one time, I can put it all on the screen following this. Now, it has a moment where it, if you're scrolling up, it'll have to populate the next screen, but this has got a good processor in it, a much later version of Android than a bunch of the Autel tools have got. This is what I think, this is why I think this is probably one of the best scan tools for the money. This will do a ton of stuff. You've got graphing over here, so if you wanted to graph something, see how it changed over time. It, it auto scales, you can pinch to zoom, get more time on the screen. I, I've been in this for over 25 years. I'm saying this is a really, really good scan tool. So. 
for me, this is a definite buy, definite recommendation. I don't think you're going to be upset buying this tool.